In this video, I'll be explaining exactly how to install any PS1 or PSP game onto your PS Vito using Chevy Sign 2. So the first thing you want to do is open up the PlayStation Store, and you want to search for a PSP demo. Now there's a few of these, and it depends entirely on what your PSN region is, which ones are available. I'll show you this on screen here, but I know for a fact that the Ape Quest demo is available on my where I am, so I'm just going to search for this and I'll grab the Ape Quest out of the pack. Alright, so now that's done installing, it's going to install, and it's now here. So next, after this, you don't actually need to play this, you just need to open up the content manager and copy this game to your computer. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is go copy content, then PC, then we're going to select how we're going to do it. I'm going to use Wi-Fi. So now you want to click PS Vito System to PC. Then Applications. Then PSP slash Other. And now we're going to select our ApeQuest demo and copy it over to the PC. Just click OK. And now that's done, I'm going to go over to my computer and use Chubby Sign. Alright, so the next thing you want to do is download Chubby Sign 2. Um, you want to go to the graphics version, the GUI version. So you just want to then, once you get that, you just should want to get a zip file. If you extract it, you should get a file like this. And then inside there should be Chubby Sign v2.exe. So you want to open this up. And you should get a window like this. Now, what you want to do is click the Get Keys button. And if you use those demos I mentioned, you can click Keys.txt. Otherwise, you'll need to click Eboot PvP, and you'll be limited to the same game type as the one you use. But since I used um, one of those demos, I'm going to click this one. And you'll see here, it will come up, ApeQuest. So select Content Manager Backup, and almost immediately you'll see this pop up here, and this pop up here. Now we'll do the same thing for the PlayStation 1 menu. You can go to here and use ApeQuest, and boom, we got the information in here for this. So yeah, it's a PlayStation 1 disk. So I'm going to go over here to disk 1, and you just need to select the... Uh, I bin Q file. I'm going to go with uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. So let's just use that. So Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories. Like that. Alright, and I'm going to click go. Once it go, it should begin creating this backup. So now that has been done, I'm also going to do a PlayStation Portable game just to show that also works. So I'm going to do Final Fantasy Tactics War of the Lions. So I'm just going to go on this one too. Okay, so now that's also done. So now I'm going to go back onto my PS Vita and copy these over. Okay, so now I get the games back. I'm going to go copy content again, then PC, then however you want to do it. And this time I'm going to go PC to PS Vita. And then applications. And first, I'll copy over the Yu Gi Oh games and I'll go PlayStation. And I'll just click on the game. You'll see it come up here and copy. And now that's done. We're going to go cancel, then PSP other. Alright, and now I'm going to click on the Final Fantasy Tactics game. Copy that over as well. So now both of those are done, we're just going to exit out of this and go back to the 
now both of us are done, we're going to exit out of this and go to the games. Okay, so now I have finished copying these games over, so I'm just going to show you all. They start, so here is Yu-Gi-Oh! This game wasn't even released on the PSN in any region, but you'll see here it will work fine.